So, hey, it's Mike, and I've been doing some thinking as of late. See, it's been getting kind of monotonous just making the same old content I've kind of been doing for like the better half of what feels like a year or so now. I honestly lost track of how long I've been making these videos constantly of just like Fortnite missions or PSO2 content. Just, it, it gets kind of monotonous after all, just editing together those real quick and then just throwing them on the channel rapid fire sometimes even because like I'd just be not bothering to upload for weeks or even months potentially and then just dumping a whole lot of stuff on once just to get off the hard drive or whatever but that kind of brings me to like a whole matter regarding like the content itself like I, I just kind of get this feeling that it, it gets kind of boring like it's just same old, same old, and I'm just uploading clips. Like, yeah, there might be some interesting shots of, like, some good gameplay here or there, or what have you, or maybe some story missions that might seem interesting to someone. I don't know. I'm not really sure, like, who's watching my content, to be honest. I mean, somebody must be. I, I somehow get more than zero consistently. So, thanks for that, but, like, I don't even know why you like what I be making, I'll be honest. Because, like, it, it just doesn't seem all that interesting. Like, in all this time that I've been, like, on the web, like, whenever it comes to, like, YouTube content I'm watching, it's usually because, like, there's something about the title or, like, the subject matter or something that at least grabs me, you know? And I feel like I've kind of been lacking in that regard, like... We just want to watch me, like, do, like, another raid boss of the week in PSO2, or just get another victory round, whatever Fortnite's doing at the moment. I don't know. Just always kind of wondered about that, you know? It's like, I could be making stuff more substantial. I've been working on this bit of a project of mine that I've been planning to do since March, but I haven't really, like, started making strides for until late June. It's a Sonic Timeline video initially, but I decided to expand into more like an overall Sonic lore video series, because there's just so much Sonic content to cover that's canon to the game continuity that it would be kind of difficult to fit everything into a single video at this point, unless I'm just, like, Rapid fire dropping the names and like seeing what chronological order they are without giving too much context. Which would be easier to make, sure, but if say there is like a newbie that knows next to nothing about Sonic and kinda wants like a videos that actually cover like what goes on in like all of these games so that they actually kinda get a bit more in the know. It kind of makes sense to like do something like that because like there's plenty of videos out there that actually try, like to cover the lore of an entire series, or at least try to for the most part for like a few videos at least. When it comes to like specific IP and introducing new potential new fans into like what the series is all about and stuff, and I figured. I'm something of a Sonic lore master myself. Maybe not the more reputable ones, but I, I know a thing or two about Sonic history. I know about, like, all these different games and what comes before and after what and all these minute details with, like, specific things about, like, what the characters are into and what they're capable of and what have you and etc. and so on. It's like, yeah, I could do that for Sonic. Why not? It'd be fun. Even if it probably take forever because god damn there's a, over 30 years worth of games to cover mostly in the 90s and 2000s but still just a lot to go over that being said like the whole process of making this video series has been giving me a bit of perspective and I guess that's why I've been making this update video because like it has me thinking like I could be making more substantial content than just standard gameplay footage. 
Like, even here, I'm basically just using stuff as B-roll to kind of talk over this kind of stuff. I could do videos like that as well. Maybe just talk about, like, whatever's interested in me in the moment, or whatever's, like, going on in the world right now, like, news-wise. Maybe not too political, though, because that can be very divisive and just be, like, a pain in the ass to talk about in general, especially with, like, how just... how stupid some stuff can be. And... Discussing politics is already enough of a headache as is. No matter what political faction the other person's on, really. But yeah. It's like, I want to make stuff that's actually fun to make. Instead of just feeling like something I'm doing because I, my PS4 needs more space and there's too much gameplay footage taking up data I need for like being able to download another game or being able to like run things properly. It actually became an issue at one point because these Fortnite updates be ridiculous. So, what I'm gonna do is that my upload schedule, I'm not sure how consistent it will be in the future. Maybe I'll just do like shorter type content like this, where I kind of just like talk about things that interested me in the moment or like whatever is gonna happen with the channel in the near future. And when it's done, I'll have like the big projects. Like, this whole Sonic timeline thing I'm working on kind of come into the picture when it's done. Because yeah, the Sonic timeline thing is going to take a while. Like, these are going to be some big son of a guns. Yeah. Believe me, I, I, I've been working on this script for days. So like, if I'm going to be doing recaps, that, that alone is going to take a while. Because, like, I'm going over, like... All the timeline shenanigans and like I, I feel like Sonic 06 by itself is gonna take like a whole episode to talk about with like all of its weird time travel inconsistencies and paradoxes and shit compared to every other game in the series. Oh, that's that's not gonna be fun. <laughs> yeah. I think that's like a good direction to kinda take my content going forward. I'm not sure, like, if that'll be something that'll not really interest in whoever's watching my stuff right now, but I don't know, we'll see what happens, I guess. I've also noticed from recording this that I'd be pausing way too dang often when I'm not reading off of a script. Jeez Louise. I really need to work on that. Like, I never have this problem when I'm in a conversation with somebody. It mainly just happens when I'm trying to record on my own like this. Like, you ever have those moments where you're... You have, like, all this stuff that you want to say, and, like, you're saying in the spur of the moment while you're doing something else, and, like, you know exactly what you want to say, when you want to say it, and you're saying it with, like, some gusto, with some emotion to it and shit. And when you finally, like, get around to, like, get into your recording equipment and such, it's like, you're just drawing blanks all of a sudden, and it's like, I, I knew what I was talking, what I wanted to talk about like a couple of hours ago, why ain't it coming out now, and it's like, it'd it just be such an annoying thing to happen so much. Maybe it's a remnant of when I had stage fright as a kid, because I'm not sure if I ever really got over that entirely, but who knows. The Sonic video I'm making is kind of helping with that a little, at least. Even if it is, like, because I'm reading off of a script multiple times, so I'm kind of, like, trying to add a bit more, like, enthusiasm, some character with my voice instead of just reading it blankly as I go, like, each time I practice with it. That being said, though, thanks for watching, I know that. Maybe this is not the most interesting thing to hear about, or maybe it does interest you, who knows. But I do plan to, like, actually try to see what I can do with 
this channel in the future. I don't know if it'll become like something profitable, cause like I'm mainly just kind of doing this for like the heck of it, you know? Like I make what I enjoy making. It's like I was mostly just putting up like the gameplay footage because I enjoy playing these games and like saving like cool moments I managed to do in these games. But, like after a certain point, it's like. Maybe I could do something more with this, like, editing-wise. Maybe I could use it for something more interesting beyond just, hey, look at this cool thing I did while playing this game. And we'll see where that goes. At least I hope so. So yeah, do the YouTube things if you want. You already know what those are. I don't need to explain that. And... See y'all later, I guess. And yes, I did time that edit specifically for that moment. I'd, I'd be like that sometimes.